On this episode, we're in Zion National Park. Most people, when they think of Zion National Park, think of this area right here, which is Zion Canyon. It's a gorgeous place, but we were there a couple years ago, so we want to focus our attention on some of the less visited areas of the park. So we're going to go over this way and then up the Kolob Terrace Road to the Connector Trail for some snowshoeing. And then back down and way around here up to Kolob Canyons to do the Taylor Creek Trail. And I'll give you a spoiler, it's a wet one. We are on Kolob Terrace Road and the ranger at the visitor center yesterday told us that there might be a place out this way where we can snowshoe. So we're going to find out. So far there's no snow, but we just turned onto the road. I think we have like 11 more miles to go before we get to where he said that we might be able to snowshoe. So we'll see. to see some snow. We were starting to wonder if we were going to see any, if there was any chance at all of snow shooting, but got up to about 5,000 feet and the snow arrived. Alright, we found a spot to ditch the truck off the side of the road since the uh, trailhead hadn't been plowed yet. Not only had it not been plowed, but all the snow from the road was plowed in front of it, so there was no getting in there. So we got suited up, and off we go. Yep. We can't see the trail, so we're going to have to try and... We're just going to go and just... Yeah, make some educated guesses but we'll take you along. Well, we've gone a little ways, not too far with the snowshoes. What, what do you think? Awesome. It's really cool. I mean, like, just look over here, what we're headed toward, kind of. That's our view the whole way. This is incredible. We actually finally found the real trail. We're doing the connector trail mm -hmm. in the Hop Valley region. So. You can see someone walked through here previously in the, probably when it was powder. It's kind of a little more icy now. It's very deep though. It's very deep. It's very deep. I fell a moment ago and plunged in pretty deep. So <laughs> I was, had to crawl my way out. <laughs> but the snowshoes are doing a good job of keeping us on top. Yeah. I mean, you can see the tracks there. We're staying right on top, just like yeah, you're supposed to. It is awesome. This is epic Zion snowshoeing right here. It's great. It's fun. You're staying aloft really well, and I'm starting to sink as the snow warms. Well, I'm I'm my snow through a lot more than I was. Uh, not as much as I am. My snowshoes must be faulty. Yeah, I'm sure that's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> well, what'd you think of our first real run at snowshoeing? It was fun. It wasn't as hard as I expected it to be either. I didn't fall at all. You did this. <laughs> yeah, I did. I, I fell once. I think you just got your snowshoes crossed. Once you kind of get going, it's a piece of cake. It's fun. It's good. It's great that this area is very less visited. 
than the rest of the national park. Yeah. I think we've seen like three cars and two people the whole time. It's amazing. It's a great day too. What a view. Wow. Looks like somebody had lunch here. Something ate a big old bird. Yeah, I ate the big bird. I don't know what that was. But lots of feathers and a carcass. We had a great time snowshoeing. It was our first opportunity to try out our new snowshoes, and it was awesome. Now, why don't you come along with us to the Taylor Creek hike up in the Kolob Canyons area of the park. Keep in mind while watching that we stopped at the visitor center to check with the ranger to see what the trail conditions were like before the hike. He mentioned that, hey, we might want to take our yak tracks because it's a little snowy in a few sections, and that there might be a couple of creek crossings. All right, enough talking. Let's go have a look. You're just trying to catch me to catch me falling. No, just filming. <laughs> it's a little steep and snowy. Really slippery. We both have yak tracks on, so hopefully that's enough. They're not real aggressive though. Probably not aggressive enough for this terrain. If it was flat, it wouldn't be too bad, but it's so steep. Show them your yak tracks. Turn around and flip your leg up. We are at the Taylor Creek Trail in the Kolob Canyon area of Zion National Park. Awesome. It is a five mile round trip hike. I don't know if we'll go all the whole way because it's pretty slippery and snowy and muddy and where, where it's not snowy. So we'll see. And I'm not sure how much of it I'll walk backwards without, without falling. Woo, almost ate it. <laughs> Tricky stuff.
This trail turned out to be a little bit more difficult than we were prepared for after having snowshoed all morning, so we decided to turn around at the frozen waterfall. It also seemed like more than a few creek crossings, so we counted on the way back. We just finished our hike on the Taylor Creek Trail. We did not go all the way to the end. It was too snowy and, and difficult. It was it was a challenging hike. Yeah, mostly because of the snow and the creek crossings. We did 27 creek crossings. And that was one way. It was an out and back, so it was, you know, twice that. Yeah. We just counted them on the way back. <laughs> but we went to the, there's a cabin about a mile in, and then there's a kind of an icy waterfall, I don't know, a mile and a half, two miles in, something mm -hmm. like that. It's really cool. So we made it to the waterfall and back. It's yep. getting dark, so we kind of had to hightail it back, didn't do a lot of filming on the way back. Good hike. Hope you enjoy the video. It was a tough one. <laughs>